So as long as you don't bring the Fuse buff to hostage. Fuse actually might be the most banned operator in the game. I'm not gonna lie, this was probably so unexpected. I don't think people realize how good Fuse is going to be. Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. We've got an important video to talk about today. I'm really excited. Hope you guys are having a great day so far. And if you guys are new to the channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button to never miss a video. Stay updated and turn on that notification bell. That way you guys never, ever miss a video. So if you guys haven't been keeping up with Siege in the past few months, there's a new season coming out and there's a lot of good changes. One of those changes we're actually going to be talking about today is the Fuse buff. So Fuge got a huge buff. I'm not going to lie, this was probably so unexpected. Now, a quick rundown for you guys if you don't know what the new season is, kind of all the highlights. So there is the new operator, Osa, coming out. She is a attacker with a defensive shield kind of type. It's like a clear shield, and it's a really powerful gadget on attack now. I'm going to have another video where I, I kind of explain little strats you can do with her, so make sure you guys are subscribed. Another great change is that Coastline, Bank, and clubhouse are finally getting those bars removed you know the ones that eat all your bullets when you're shooting at someone and it's just it's been killed it makes you want all f4 and just never play the game but these map changes rather than having a new map rework this is actually i think it's a lot better than having a new map for now it's kind of fine-tuning the older maps and i think one of my favorite changes of the new season is the fuse buff and personally i don't hear a lot of new people talking about it as much as the new op but in my opinion, Fuse actually might be just as good as the new op. So let's take a look back at the old Fuse. Old Fuse, you could only put it on soft floors. It was kind of loud and predictable as well. I think the only thing that was good about Fuse is that he had a good weapon and the heart breaching device. I'm not going to lie to you guys, Fuse is slow as But now that we upgraded to the new Fuse, Fuse is still slow as He still has the heart breaching device, but his gadget is massively buffed guys i need you guys to think about it on reinforced walls and actually one of the biggest problems of fuse is that you are really vulnerable when putting down those fuse charges because you could get c4 you could get shot through it but now that you can deploy them on like hatches and reinforced walls that's basically thatcher but better like just imagine all the annoying cades and you know having to grenade above a wall for like those bandit charges no longer have to do that all you have to do is be extremely safe outside behind a reinforced wall unbothered that is what blows my mind so we have seen a big update from the old fuse to the current fuse and that's my probably my first point of how good fuse is going to be is that he can put them through reinforced walls now i want you guys to take a second and think about all of the you know any kind of your favorite map think about like the wall that is hardest to get because there's always some bandit tricking or there's someone putting like an invincible Cade Claw. Now basically you have Thatcher on the board, but he actually kills people now. So as long as you don't bring the Fuse buff to hostage, we could we, should, we will be okay. Now the second point that makes Fuse so good right now is that he replaces Thatcher in a way. Now, now I know I might be getting low ahead of myself. In my eyes, I think Fuse is going to be the new Thatcher. And you know, you guys know what that means. Thatcher's no longer going to be a 24-7 band operator, man. I'm actually going to have to be able to play the L8 now with the 2.0. I mean, Sledge doesn't have the 2.0. He has ACOG on his L8, but he's getting his SMG alone taken away because he didn't know that. Now, that's just for another video, you know. You know. Well, we'll talk about Sledge SMG 11 later, but make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. That way, you guys don't miss that video too. And now, honestly, with Fuse being, you know, the new Thatcher in a way, and he could put them to reinforce walls, I think the shield meta is really... It's really going down the drain. With this new change of fuse, it kind of reminds me of Flores in a way. Flores, honestly, by himself, is kind of bringing down the overall pick rate of shields and strats a little bit down more. And if he fills up, if he gets end up getting banned, that means Thatcher's on the board. So I think, in my opinion, we're slowly moving out of a util, you know, sit behind a shield kind of meta. And now that we have fuse and we have Flores, and you know, with the Jaeger changes, I really think that we're going to get a new meta soon. And that's what makes me so excited about the ch these changes. I can't wait to see them live in action. And now that Fuse is kind of actually playable now, he still has the AK-12, which I believe is also getting a nerf too. 
but either way you still have the fuse lmg i don't know what it is but ubisoft just wants us to move to lmgs more zofia nerfed go to her lmg fuse ak nerfed go to fuse lmg soon all i'm be hearing i'm gonna be spawning in and i'm just gonna hear bullets until the end of the round so fuse has also a hard breaching device which i think really makes him a package the only downside i would say about fuse is that he does not have any kind of burn and when I talk about burn, like, you know, flashbangs to, you know, get rid of wise, all that kind of stuff. But that's not really his role because he's always going to be above or outside the site, you know, banging it up. So overall, what you guys need to know, new seasons coming out with a lot of new balancing changes. I think in, we're actually getting in a way new content. It may not be a new map. We're getting good fine tune of our older maps, getting rid of the bars. In my opinion, getting rid of the bars is a huge dub in my book fuse buff along with many other operator changes we have not talked about yet so make sure you guys are subscribed i really enjoy talking over this kind of stuff because it i, I just can't wait to start playing fuse more and i hope you guys are excited and this makes you want to play fuse more as well and we're on the road to a huge 30k and i appreciate you guys very much for watching today if you guys are going to end up playing fuse after this leave a like on the video and i'll see you guys in the next video